Our pay award for 2023 is currently pitched at the same amount as has been offered to other public sector workers. 45 to 5% represents more for the civil service than we've had in any recent year and has only happened because of the industrial action and the campaign that we have been waging. So I want to say now loud and clear to every member who's been on strike in our National Days of Strike Action or taken months of targeted strike action, your action has been effective and it has forced the government for the first time in a long time to say in 2023, you will get at least as much as others are being offered. Now, of course, we know that other workers have already rejected out of hand a pay offer of 45 to 5% for 2023. That is not enough. It's half the rate of inflation and we need more. But where the government have insulted you absolutely in an outrageous way today is they have confirmed that we are the only group of workers in the public sector that are not being offered either a lump sum compensation payment or a backdated award to deal with the cost of living crisis from 2022's pay. Our offer of 2 to 3% last year was lower than anyone else. But unlike our colleagues in health or education or the fire service, our offer is not being backdated this year and we are not being offered a one-off lump sum. When you throw into that that we're also not getting any offer at the moment on pensions or redundancy, this is a completely unacceptable announcement that the government has made today.